Well, folks, coming at you with an emergency video because we got wildfires raging tonight, okay? We got the Eggman drama between Heel versus Babyface, Asmund Gold, Sweet Baby Ink. You probably heard about the story, right? Like the video if identity politics shouldn't be in our games. Dislike the video if you constantly need to be told what a male and what a female is. And dislike the video if you think there are billions and billions of genders. Everybody's getting fed up right now. And get your popcorn, put your seatbelts on, and, and check this Doing out. Doing it. Yeah, Holy I think people are mad. So this is really what... This is what the drama was. Because Actman made, like, a whole video about this. Yeah. Alright, what's up, everybody? This video is going to be posted on Twitter. It's going to be here. the evidence I talked about in regards to the Sweet Baby Ink stuff. If you're in the loop yeah. on that, great. If not, long story short, I made a tweet about Sweet Baby Ink looking into it. And it has reignited the discourse around Starfield. Yeah, wait for it. So let's start with this. This account made this tweet. Those of you that don't know, apparently the Ackman actually called out this guy to be like gorilla shape. Bruh. Something like that. And he said that shoot the guy with a trank, bear tranquilizer. It was absolutely heated though. It started versus how it's going. You know, kind of clowning on me a little yeah, sure. bit. And I'm like, I don't recall hearing about Sweet Baby Ink when all that Starfield discourse was going down. So I've only learned of this company's existence in the last week or so. By the way, it turns out Starfield has no connection with Sweet Baby Inc. as far as we know. My offer to Az is still open if he changes his mind and, and wants to talk with me, public or private. So here's what Az says. We had an opportunity to speak. I lost interest when you were talking out of both sides of your mouth. One side saying you wanted to talk and we were trying to arrange a time. Yeah. The other side making more videos shitting on me for views as you were just another content engagement farmer. You showed me who you were, someone not worth the time of day. Okay. This is This kind of upsets me. Yeah. Because content <laughs> engagement farmer. Meanwhile, now listen, man. I do like the Eggman's content, and he had such a goaded channel. But I don't know what happened. Like, I, I nobody expected the Eggman to actually attack the guy the way he did. He called him like bear, your gorilla shape man. You need to be sh uh, shot down with a like bear tranquilizer. And the all what heel versus babyface was saying that bro, like keep the identity politics out of the games. It's not just one game that it's in it. It's like every game right now. And right now, like, the entire Sweet Baby Ink situation is coming out. It's unfolding. It's such a bad look for the Ackman. But I feel like that he can learn from his mistake and uh, get it moving. But people are not stopping, man. Everybody's going uh, crazy right now. Wait Yesterday, for you made a 13-minute video based off of two tweets I made. Who's farming? You say Dog, you called him, like, Gorilla Shiv. He's mad about that, bro. Content and engagement. There's nothing wrong with farming. Okay? Like, I farm all the time. All I fucking do is farm. Farming, but I made one video on the topic yeah. in which you were not the sole focus of it, and I didn't use your face or name in the title or thumbnail. Not much of a farm, is it? Uh, use it, bro. Like So look, man, you got your reasons for not wanting to talk to me after all this. I understand. Yeah. What I don't get is why you're continuing to fan the flames and farm me for content if that's what you're- Dog, you called him bald, bro. Like, gorilla, sh uh, uh, somebody gotta shoot you down with a bear tranquilizer. He mad, bro. Calling me out for doing. I'm po I think the reason why is because, like, Actman made a, a tweet about heel versus baby yeah, face. Yeah, yeah, yeah. About as, I guess I'll just call him as. I can't say the whole name every time. It's too much. Um, about as about how the guy was acting like a man baby and he called him a gorilla. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> I remember see yeah, calling him a gorilla. Yeah, yeah. That's really what he's mad about. He's not really <laughs> mad about the YouTube videos, right? And so And yo know, Heel versus Babyface was right though. And, and a lot of people took it out of context that he was just mad based on the pronouns. He wasn't mad only because of the pronouns. He was just mad by the fact that every game, every game is like this right now. Why do they need to shove identity politics in every game? Okay, one game here and there, two games out of 10 games. Okay, whatever. But it's like, dog, you give them the finger, they take your entire hand. That's uh, what's happening right now. Agree, disagree? Well, it, again, like, let's talk about that. Listen this is video cooking? to Twitter, man. I'm gonna make all of three dollars if I'm lucky. Mm -hmm. I don't have plans to make a video on Sweet Baby Inc. or you. So if that's what we're going to do, I'm at least going to share the DMs between me and- Yeah, we, we get it. You're an oil prince. You're not making- You're not doing this for the money. We get it. The third party would show I continuously reached out with good intentions. Mm -hmm. We could have talked on a live stream on your channel. I think a lot of people would have tuned into that. Probably uh, would have gotten a lot of views, donations, and yeah. ad revenue. Yeah. And we I could agree. have squashed the beef in front of everyone. And Facts. it's funny because something similar is happening right now with me and another creator, Tommy C. Someone who's oh. arguably criticized me 
harder than anybody else. Oh, if you remember a any of you know the drama between Tommy C? Like I, I, I've been hearing a lot, but I'm not like super deep into it. You know, maybe, maybe we'll dive into that one too. Man, this drama needs to stop. I mean, keep it going, guys. Keep it going. Keep Back it going. when my channel got demonetized, he and I had some beef. It was pretty bad. So if me and Tommy can hop on a live stream and, and hash this shit out, then you and I could have too. Again, for more context, the Starfield Hot Takes video was posted on September 13th. Now, as had posted other videos about two uh, Starfield days. discourse, yeah. we were both at the center of that. Man cancelled for having opinion on the internet. <laughs> so, yeah, of course. we're gonna Man cancelled for having opinion on the internet. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> Bruh, I mean, bruh. Oh uh, god. Act, act man. Bro, I yeah. fucking love this. Sega, Sega's are calling her, uh, him, uh, I almost said her, uh, act man. It's man. The internet. I really do. I think it's a beautiful place. It is, it is. Like content, we're YouTubers, it that's is. what we do. Yeah, it sounds familiar. I, I no bet it is. With him criticizing me in this video. I might disagree with the things mm -hmm. that he said, but the fact that he made this video at all, I have no man. problems with. So this okay. video was posted September 4th. Yeah, of course. This one's September. Yo, what are the odds like the act man, or I should say act man, Bruh. with an N, N, N at the end? What are the odds that act man just tried to be funny that day? You know, like, he just tried to be funny, bro tried to be funny, called him like gorilla shit man, shoot the guy <laughs> with a beard tranquilizer. What if he just tried to be funny, right? Like, and I, I know he wasn't because later on he followed with like a lot more stuff and he doubled down on triple down, quadruple down even, on his opinions, uh, like, yeah, they should have pronouns in the game, and the woke crap going forward in all the games, uh, because, uh, you, you know what, he got mad over what, as, uh, heel versus babyface got to say, so he was like, bro, like, uh, you, you know what, just for that, they gotta have that crap in future games as well, and that got a lot of people mad at the Ackman as well, and a lot of people were on his side, are you on Ackman's side, are you on heel, uh, baby, uh, face side, listen, man, I, I, I like both of these fellas, I like all three, of these fellas i watch their contents sometimes they got good takes sometimes they have bad takes just like you and i sometimes i also probably would have had bad takes it's just that like my channel is the smallest channel alive so even if i have bad takes you guys don't tell me uh you, you feel what i'm saying but if i have a bad take Bruh. you can uh, tell me in the you can let me know in the comments okay i won't be i won't mind that uh, i won't mind that much okay i won't call you gorilla shape okay brave so all the DMs- <laughs> The other video, I killed Starfield. I'm gonna show you, are between me and Mauler. I don't want nobody giving Mauler shit for this. He uh -oh. Mauler is actually, um, there's something I really respect and appreciate that he did. He made an eight hour video series about why Dark Souls 2 was a bad game. And I've watched the entire thing twice. And the second time while I was watching it, I was playing Dark Souls 2. It is best to try and mediate a conversation. He was in an awkward position. Nobody give Mahler shit, okay? So here are the DMs with Mahler. I say uh -oh. some people in my Twitch yeah. chat. Yo, seconds were, seconds were saying that he was gonna leak DMs though. He leaking DMs right now. He leaking. Or maybe he had permission from Mahler. Maybe. Okay, let's, uh, let's check out the sauce here. We're telling me I should ask you to set up a discussion with Az and have you be a moderator. What do you think about mm -hmm. that? September 6th. Just pay attention to the dates and times. Okay. Father says I'm super unfamiliar with the game. I don't think Az is going to be interested. He's just carrying on doing his thing. Not much of a fan of any of the viral posts about him being that there's so much missing context about his views on the whole thing. Yeah. Right. Let, let's talk and, and you can provide that content. I think Mahler seemed actually quite reasonable about it. Text to me Damn. directly. Yeah. Is there something specific you wanted to talk to him about? Well, I think it'd be good for us to talk about it. Could do well for our channels and bridge a gap, so to speak. Yeah. You make your videos. I make my video. Then we could come together, talk about it on your channel, my channel. And so he Mahler's done. DMs is deal breaker. Mahler's mad. Like people have leaked my DMs as well. This is my advice for any content creator. Yeah, don't DM. Your DMs aren't private, and people will leak them if they want. I've had people leak my DMs all the time. Yeah, like, just, I, just don't even DM, bro. Like, just don't even DM. Or if you're gonna DM, just don't even say... It's like one of those things, right? Like, on the internet, you don't want to say something that you're gonna be... For example, like, you don't want to... They always say, right, do not share your password. 
so I can still be sharing their password. Bro, yeah. You know, so don't don't share passwords, don't share important information, and certainly do not call anybody Gorilla Shape Man, okay? Otherwise, we're gonna have the all of these wildfires. Uh, man started a or yeah, ma'am or man, whatever you guys wanna call it. Man started a wildfire, bro. It constantly, Fires. people do this. Plural. Who leaked your DMs? Uh, what, that one guy from Phase. What was what was his name? The guy I called him a crackhead. Phase Rain. Yeah, there it is. Yeah, he leaked the DMs. <laughs> what? Interesting conversation. That's the, that's the most we recent one. Content. Hopefully, Yo, Phase Rain is one of the realest uh, uh, Phase guy, right? Man, I I grew up watching like uh, a lot of like Phase Rain videos back in the days, right? Especially like Black Ops Two days, and then he started doing like that. And he apparently, uh, uh, from what I'm hearing right now, he's clean actually. So shout out to Don DeMarco real quick. Uh, that, that's good, man. Like if anybody is a druggie or does Nesquik and they actually turn their life around and they're clean, I mean, shout out to them honestly. Like, uh, yeah. Squash the beef, shake hands, move on. Everyone's happy. You right. can pose the idea to him and see what he says. You know me sure. decently well. I'm not the type of person to hold grudges or hate someone just because I disagree with them. I'm sure we wouldn't just talk about the game, but the concepts of woke culture and media too. I, I wouldn't necessarily want to treat it as a debate. So at this point in time, I don't want the conversation between me and As to be treated as like, like okay, it's I'm adversarial. Right, you're wrong. Yeah. Let's fucking go. I think there's yeah. too much bad blood at this point. He doesn't believe you made those tweets in the interest of understanding the situation, but rather for engagement. Uh -oh. He's not interested, and I don't think he will be convinced otherwise. He felt very supportive of you, and a lot of what you had to go through, like the demonetization. Yeah. So obviously this has been- Man, the situation is so crazy because, like, the act man was actually demonetized on YouTube. Oh, shit! Oh, yeah, shit. Uh, I don't remember when exactly, but he was demonetized on YouTube, and a lot of people had his back, I believe. Even Heel, Heel vs. Babyface had his back. Bumbaka! If I'm not mistaken. Even I had his back. A lot of people, I mean, listen, demonetization, that's like, you know, if somebody's like making content on the internet and, and they're making like good content, right? Like the Ackman, I, I F with this content, like his content is good, right? Obviously everybody's gonna have a bad take, but like it, it does not mean that you deplatform them or, 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 or you demonetize the guy. So he was demonetized, a lot of people had his back, but it's like, you know, everybody had had your back, but you couldn't have like heel versus babyface back when he was getting uh, trash on, right? And uh, realistically, he wasn't necessarily getting trash on though till you came up and, and you like put out that tweet, and then uh, everybody like started hating on the guy without knowing the context. Like, guys, listen, yeah, he the, the pronoun stuff was actually kind of wild though. But it is not that that was the only thing he was mad about. Like, he was mad about the woke politics and the identity crap that it is in all the games. That was the crux of the the, the problem. He wasn't just mad on the pronouns, though. You, you know what I mean? Uh, but he uh, just went crazy at the guy, and now everybody's, like, uh, uh, going hard at the homie, though. It is a very sour impression. Understandable. Okay. Then let's talk in private, just the three of us. Okay. Private conversation. Not about content. Let's just try to understand each other. I made. The Why don't they just DM each other, bro? Like, I don't understand. Like, cause for me. Uh, okay, if they do that, then how else you're supposed to farm content, Asmin? Go like, think about it, bro. How else you're supposed to farm content? Like, why we need? Why, why we need a? Yeah, what's this? Like, I mean, you just DM each other. Yeah. He's farming, farming, drama, As farm, drama, has farm. Block? <laughs> Just tell him to unblock him. <laughs> tweets because I didn't understand what he was saying. And, be, and because yeah. it's, it's the internet, you know, we're public figures. You goof and gaff on me, I do the same. It's not it a big strike deal. me as a shy man. What yeah. could be the harm in a private conversation? I very much appreciate that he was supportive of my situation back then. I will always have a certain- Dog, this reactionception is killing me. <laughs> Anybody want to react to this video? You, you Go for it, okay? Go for it, my man. Go for it. Level of respect for people that did. Tell them that's why I'm reaching out. This is still true. This is still true. I still have a certain amount of respect for Az for having my back in my darkest time. It might that was a crazy. T that was as crazy. Tweet, that and I have no other way to contact. Yeah, holy crap. Yeah, Babyface, uh, uh, Heel vs. Babyface did uh, had his back, but it's like you couldn't. Damn, homie. Damn. I think Bro just wanted to be funny that day, though. Him, so I'd like to settle this bad so blood dumb. if possible. I understand if it puts you in an awkward middleman situation. I've spoken with Az, and he said he is happy to have a private chat with us. The idea of no audience and just us to figure out the miscommunications, differences in a call will yeah. have some good outcome, outcomes. Only he's gotten a fever, and I think- yeah! Man, he's drinking Dr. Pepper. Yo, how many Dr. Peppers he drank? It's like every time I like hop on his videos or stream, my guy be like chugging it down, though. There's a lot of sugar, big boy. Like, don't be drinking too much sugar, though. 
That's crazy, because the man. flu right now. So might need like a week before setting this up. Do you want to let me know what kind of availability you have? Mm -hmm. Sounds good. Let them know that I do have a video about Starfield hot takes going on. Nope. It's a bit late for me to unpull the trigger and it is mostly for content purposes. As he made a couple videos on this subject, I hope he understands. There are more important things than our squabble disagreement on this subject. He stuck up for me in my darkest hour, so I want to make sure he knows he has an ally should oh. his channel ever face any unfair demonetization Dang. of videos or God forbid his channel gets, gets deleted. Terminated. Yeah, yeah. That's what I was going to say. So at this point, you might be asking the question, well, if you're trying to mend the bridge, why did you post? Uh, I think, uh, okay, listen, I might get canceled just for saying this. I, I feel like that it's just high school drama, though. I feel like that the act main he he had a lot of good takes it's just one of the take that i, d I disagree with and a lot of people do as well uh, uh, and i feel like that everybody deserves second chances though i feel like that they should just uh, bond up you know square it up uh, you know what i mean they always say right uh, square it up square, square it up homie you know they all, don't they don't they have a saying some a saying like that right you probably know what i'm talking about let me know in the comments uh, I, I feel like that we should all just uh, forgive and forget and kind of move on but certainly not forget the sweet baby ain't though that's the enemy right now we should be keeping the pressure on that situation and not like uh uh, attack Ackman or heal versus babyface uh, because uh, we, we right now I feel like that everybody understand uh, the, uh, about the common enemy the common enemy is sweet baby ink the woke politics all that crap that's been in our in our games right now you, you feel what I'm saying also in the movies but here we just specifically talking gaming you feel what I'm saying it's the video there's a few reasons no, it's not a big fucking deal. He wasn't even part of the video. It was just a little small amount of the video. And yeah, it was kind of ridiculous what he the way he acted. Like, yeah, 100%. Like, also, like, didn't I get posted in the Starfield Hot Takes video too? Like, I I'm pretty sure I did. Yeah, I did. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I... <laughs> Asman, <laughs> Asman, you are in every video, lol, bro. Bro, literally running like a farm gold TV. <laughs> Who cares? For one, this Twitter exchange yeah. took place over a week, and I had no indication un until uh -huh. I finished the video that As was down to talk to me. This is pretty bad timing. I just spent 30, 35, 40 hours on a video. What am I going to do? Just scrap it? Reason yeah. I posted nah, you're it. Not, yeah. I didn't think it would hurt his feelings, honestly. Damn. Damn. In fact, yeah. I made a concentrated effort to make the video not just about him. I included a bunch of different uh, Starfield hot takes. He seemed like the type of guy who could take criticism, roll with the punches, and, oh, and laugh at no, himself. Oh, no, no, you're going to now play that card, bro. Come on, man. But, but now I see where he's coming from. But, dog, you called him gorilla shit, though. You call him gorilla Bruh. shit, shoot the guy with the beard tranquilizer. <laughs> you, you said all that word, man. Like, you, I feel like that he's just mad because you, you called him bald. I think that's what it is. Sure. But I respected that. It's not that big I'll of a deal. I'll be available until the 16th. I'll be leaving to go visit someone. As he made a couple videos on the subject, I hope he understands. We're content creators. We make videos. We're both involved in this. I don't have any problems it's with not him a making big deal. videos about yeah. it, so I expect the same courtesy. I, I expect the it understanding not, right? that we can critique each other on videos and come together and actually talk to each other like real people. It's uh -huh. very important he understands that whatever our disagreements on this subject, I am 100% willing to help him should his channel ever be in jeopardy. That being said, I put many hours into this latest video and I can't just pull it. He seems strong-willed though, so hopefully it doesn't bother- Okay, so this is like the Ackman tweets, right? This is from September 13, yeah, okay. I believe that this is when the, yeah, uh, around this time I, re I, I remember, yeah, this is when the drama blew up. And it was kind of petty, like, uh, as, uh, you know, uh, heel versus babyface getting all, like, uh, effing pronouns and all that. But deep down when you check out what he was mad about, he wasn't necessarily mad about the pronouns. He was more so mad about the fact which we uh, talked about previously. ...other him much. Big okay. fucking miscalculation on my part. Uh oh. It did. Uh -oh. I'd be down for a private chat. Come back from my trip. Yo, yo, uh -oh. any updates? Mm -hmm. I think after the new video, he's absolutely not interested, and that's putting it nicely. Sorry, dude. I think you were both stand up guys, but some things just don't work out. So, this is how I start to get the impression <laughs> that Az just wanted a one sided shit slinging contest. He wanted to be the one to be able to make videos. And as I've been showing you, he's ducking every opportunity to actually confront and talk to oh, me. Oh, he's just pissed off because he got farmed. Like, that's the reason why. What are we talking about? Oh, why is this happening? Bald, As is pissed because everybody dunked on him for what he said about Starfield. Everybody was shitting on him, and he's mad. Like, what the fuck? It's not that complicated, is it? Yeah, like, bro. I like mean, you... shit. He started uh, He started going to the gym right after you called him, like, uh, gorilla shape as well, bro. right? 
I, I mean, technically he was going to the gym before too, but but it's like he started posting his gym bros pictures right after you called him that. So yeah, he mad, bro. He mad, bro. You talked, you you told everybody somebody shoot the guy. Like, come on, bro. Uh, with the bear tranquilizer, I need to be very specific. I don't want to like send another like a heat wave at the homie act man. You know what I mean? It made him bald? No, that's not. He's been bald for his. It made him bald? No, that's not. He's been bald for his. I, I, like eight years ago, he was bald. Directly. All, all of these DMs he's been had to bald. be done through a third party because he wouldn't reach out to me. <laughs> Why though? I don't understand. He made his videos and I made one. So what's the deal? Again, I don't mm -hmm. want to press and make either of you uncomfortable. Honestly, bro, like a uh, heel versus babyface should say that, yeah, because of act ma'am, I got bald. Comfortable or anything, but I'm genuinely confused. Yeah. I'm fine with his videos about me being up. I didn't think he was the type of guy to let stuff like that bother him too much. Damn. Miscal I, I feel like that you actually saying that this is the type of stuff that wouldn't bother him actually bothered him. Miscalculation. Miscalculation mm -hmm. on my part. Rules for thee, but not for me. I get to talk yep. shit. You can't, you can't make content about this act, man. No, no, no. Only I get to. He doesn't believe it's about understanding the situation, so he's not interested. I've asked him a decent bit in a lot of ways, just not meant to be. What does he think my intentions are? If it's a private call, I'm not going to record it to put him on blast or anything. That would be super scummy and make me... Like, in my opinion, I do think Actman kind of made a mistake by trying to push this so much because it's obviously Az doesn't want to talk to him. Fuck him, man. Who cares? Like, if Az doesn't want to see your perspective... I feel like that... I don't know, man. I, I, yeah, like, okay, yeah, Ackman is, like, saying a lot of stuff in the DMs, right? And the way it sounds like that, it's like, hey, bro, like, I want to jump on a call, I want to squash the beef, I want to end this, uh, like, you know what, you, you know, I, I'm a good guy, like, uh, you, you feel what I'm saying? Like, we want to squash it, like, I, I feel like that we, we step on a wrong foot here and there. Uh, yeah, we had agreements, disagreements, but let's actually squash it, right? But he started, like, uh, saying it over and over and over and over and he does not want to talk to him and uh, that kind of bothered him but but this is we're talking september of last year actually then that's not your problem it's like he blocks you like who gives a fuck the, the guy him. is just yeah fuck him and, and it's like I, I would just be like listen if he wants to talk about it like it, you know i'm down like whenever let him know that i'm still like you know i'm not just gonna like fucking hate him forever and like that's Bad it fate yeah farm even as wants to cry, he should have doubled down and made more fun of Babyface, bruh. Harder? Yeah, Axeman just wants to resolve it. Yeah, no, and I get it, right? And, like, I see it from his perspective. I see why he would do it. Of course it makes sense why he'd do it, right? Because, like, he doesn't want to have an enemy or somebody like that. Especially, I yeah. think that he might feel a little bit guilty, right? Because, you know, he said... He, uh, I think it's a little bit of both. The fact that he's, like, pers this persistent and asking for... Let's jump on a call! Let's jump on a call. He surely does feel guilty and, uh... He, he just want to apologize, uh, pro probably, privately, or maybe not necessarily apologize, but like, uh, yeah, my bad, bro, I didn't mean that, this and that. I don't think he deleted the tweets, and I don't think he wa- uh, Okay, the, the thing with deleting tweets is just that if he were to delete tweets, then a lot of people would call him weak, this and that, and yeah, he would look a lot uh, more weak, I, I don't know, like... A lot of likes on your tweets on the internet doesn't mean- A lot of likes on your tweet doesn't mean you're right, but if you got a lot of likes on your tweet on the internet, that means you're right, essentially. Bruh. That's like the mentality. Uh, as, like, defended him whenever Actman got demonetized, and now he might feel guilty because he's like, oh, am I shitting on this guy who helped me? And so he wanted to resolve it because it made him feel bad? I think that's reasonable, right? Sure. Um, but yeah, it bad. seems like he just doesn't want to talk about it. That's all there is to it. Bruh. Look like a dick. What's the harm in a private conversation? Like I said, I've asked him about it. I prefer to stop yeah. sharing messages. It's just not meant to be. This is where I left it off. Well, I guess the record will show who was willing to talk and who wasn't. Who was willing to discuss Dang. things like men and who cowered away like a pussy. <laughs> I appreciate the effort. Apologies again for putting you in this awkward position. So I'm kind of upset at this point. I, 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 I'm trying my... Yeah, so this is like... the. He knew that there would be Yellowstone blow up uh, soon. So six months later, guess what? We have a new... Uh, and, and right now we're talking about the drama has reignited. We, we got a common enemy, guys. It's not that hard. It's Sweet Baby Ink. My best to talk to this guy. <laughs> there it and is. I'm not saying as didn't have valid reasons and feelings for why he didn't want to talk. It's a little frustrating, but it is what it is. We both move on. We don't have to talk. The problem yeah. I have now is that uh -oh. you are using me to farm content and engagement. You yeah, are stoking yeah, yeah. the flames while at the same time avoiding any direct 
conversation with me. See, for oh, me, like I've said before, I mean, Actman probably hasn't gone through as many controversies as I have. Like, whenever I see people farming me for content, I'm like, uh, yeah, I'd be doing the same thing. I remember there was one person who is like a very notorious drama farmer, and they were able to farm a drama that I was involved with oh, that I didn't cover because of my involvement. And I was actually, the only thing that I felt with them farming my drama is I was just jealous that I couldn't do it. Bruh. I was like, oh my god, now he gets to do this and I can't do this because it's, you know. Guys, this is the last drama that we had. Click on this video on the screen. You're not going to believe it. What truly went down in this video. Activision did confirm that these suckers are cheating though. Oh shit. Yeah, oh, shit. click on this video on the screen. On the left though, we had some bad news as well. So check, check both of these out and I'll see you right there.